everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be filming a Zaffel haul. I recently made a purchase from Zaffel and I thought it'd be a really helpful video to just show you guys everything I got and give you my honest opinion on them. I know a lot of people are a bit skeptical about Zaffel, so I thought this video would be really helpful to just show you guys what I got and also just talk about the quality, the prices, whether I think it's worth it or not. Before I show you guys everything, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. You know where the button is, it's down below. And without further ado, let's get into the haul. So I'm going to start off with clothes. I only bought two tops and they're like the same top, but in different colours. So I got the typical off the shoulder, long sleeve tops. Got one in white and then I also got it in black which I really like as well I think these are super cute and you can wear them with like a lot of things like jeans shorts I think they literally go with so many things and they are really cute at the time I bought these these retailed for $8.99 and that is in US dollars because Zaffle is in US dollars but it is still super cheap and I definitely think the quality is really good it literally feels like any other top I would buy from like Glassons or something. I'm very impressed. The only thing that is annoying is the arms don't stretch a lot. That is a problem that a lot of people have with these tops and I'm just not really happy with that. But for the price you pay, I probably wouldn't expect everything to be spot on. I definitely still recommend these if you have really small arms. It might be better for you. I think these are still a thumbs up. Alright, now I'm going to show you guys the swimwear I purchased. So I purchased three pairs and I like two of them. I don't like one of them. I will not be wearing one of them and I'll show you guys the one I won't be wearing first. So it's like this little bandeau with these little armholes so it sort of gives you that off the shoulder look. And I don't know why I bought this because I knew it wouldn't be super comfortable. So I bought this in a medium. And it looks really big, but it's actually pretty small on. It doesn't really stretch a lot. But also these armholes, again, are only really good if you have really small arms. But the actual quality of the material is really good. This is the kind of piece I would wear for, like, photos. I wouldn't actually wear it in the water because it is quite uncomfortable. I might still keep it and see how I feel. Here are the bottoms and these are a medium as well but again they don't stretch a lot. I might still keep them and see how I feel. This bikini retailed for $11.99 at the time I purchased it. These next pair of bathers are also a pair of white bathers. They are just like a triangle bikini shape and I'm quite happy with these. I also got these in a medium. The quality of the fabric is pretty similar to the other one and I'm pretty happy with this. I took the padding out because it was a bit weird but it's also really good. It has a clasp and also these adjustable straps. I didn't have a white bikini and I wanted to get one and this bikini was $8.49 when I bought it which I think is a really good price for the quality you get. I will definitely be wearing this one when I go on holiday. And then here are the bottoms. They are like these high-waisted bottoms. I think they're really cute. They're also really good quality. Here's the back. I definitely am going to give this one a thumbs up. With this last bikini, I decided to try something different because I always get like black or white or something pretty neutral so I decided to pick up a red one and I'm very happy with this this is also in a medium and the quality of this one is probably my favorite out of all of them it also has a clasp at the back and adjustable straps which is really great it looks exactly like the picture and I love the color it's so bright it's literally so bright here are the bottoms. Again, they're really similar to the last ones. I'm really happy that I tried out something different because I really like them. This bikini retailed for $12.99 at the time I purchased it. So it was the most expensive one out of all three. But I'm still going to have to give this one a thumbs up because it is my favorite one out of all the bikinis I purchased. 
So that was everything I purchased from Zaffle. If you have any more questions, feel free to leave them down below and I will definitely answer them. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate all your support. Please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed and also subscribe to my channel because I post videos every Saturday and you wouldn't want to miss one. So click that subscribe button and I will see you guys next Saturday for another video. God bless. Bye.